back to the state class B girls basketball tournament for the rugby Panthers. The Panthers are making their second straight trip to state and third in the last four years. The team is led by four seniors and are hoping that it can continue to build on the solid defense and carry that over into state tournament play. We're playing our best basketball right now. We're certainly playing our best defense. Um, offensively, I think we had some great people step up in the uh, region tournament, hit some cut shots for us. Carson Hager, Annie Steyer, Brooke Blesson played a phenomenal regional championship game. So hopefully we can get her to step up here, come up this next weekend in Grand Forks. Most of our whole team has been there already. And us four seniors, we've been there three times now. So we definitely have the experience. And the young girls have been there, most of them. So I think it definitely helps. Now the Panthers' first round opponent will be top ranked and unbeaten Kidder County. Although the Wolves are unbeaten, they're a fairly young team that features only one senior. Well, I think they're a lot like us. They're very athletic. They're young. Um, they shoot the ball very well from the outside. Um, they have an eighth grade post player, very similar to MLS. Uh, I think we have very similar um, tendencies offensively and defensively, so I would expect it to be a battle. I mean, I think we match up pretty well with them. They're short and quick, you know, and that's kind of what we are too. So once again, we just got to stick to defense. You know, that's kind of our thing and play tough defense and hopefully they'll give us a win. All right, tournament action begins on Thursday in Grand Forks at 1 o'clock. Langdon will take on Kindred. 2.45, Thompson will meet up with Shiloh Christian. And the first game of the evening session, number one, Kidder County and the Rugby Panthers. And at 8.15, Trenton will meet up with Henninger Scranton.